Hello, I am dedicating this to the commenter who was having trouble with the spa washcloth pattern. So um, here's kind of how to do the pattern. I'm just going to essentially make a mini version of this. Um, so the first thing we do is we need to um, make a chain. So I'm going to go ahead and make my loop and make a chain. And I'm hoping by just watching me do this, this will answer some of the questions for the beginners. So I've made my loop, tighten it a little bit. And it says um, chain 29 to change width, add or subtract chains and multiples of four. So I'm only gonna do um, about half of this, let's see. Uh, so 29 minus, let's say 12, that would be 17. So I'm gonna do 17, so that, that's one. I can see one already. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Actually, I changed my mind. I'm going to do thirteen. That's another multiple, or it's twenty nine minus uh, sixteen. So now, what do we do next? We half double crochet and third chain from hook. So there's one, two, three. Now we're gonna skip one chain and then two half double crochets in the next chain. It's actually been a while since I've done this, so this is a good test of the pattern. So I skipped that one, and now I'm going to have to double crochet two times in this one. It's a little awkward in the beginning chain. But then it gets a lot easier in later rows. Repeat from that across, except in last chain, half double crochet only once. So I'm going to keep skipping one and half double crocheting. Two times. <laughs> I didn't finish my sentence. So that was two. Now I skip another one. One. I actually really like this motif of half double crochet V's essentially. And I've used it in a few other places. Now in our last one, we're only supposed to half double crochet once. Okay, so that was the end of row one. Now I need to chain two, which does count as a first stitch. Um, half double crochet in that first stitch. Skip one stitch, two in the next, and repeat until the end. to a second and last stitch, the top of the chain two, half double crochet only once, turn. So I th think this is the top of the half double crochet two, I mean the chain two. If it isn't, I kind of doubt anyone would ever actually notice. Now turn. So we essentially keep repeating that. So I just chain two, and in the first stitch I'm going to do one. So if you're missing a stitch, maybe it's that stitch right there, that beginning one. 
or the end. It's always the beginning or the end, right? But um, count your stitches each row and that'll help. So I just did, the first one does count, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and then the last one will be eleven. So I should keep having eleven on each row. The first one. Well, so now that's two because it chained two counted. Three, four, five, six, seven. And if your end looks bad, you can always add a single crochet border. Um, so yeah, that's the basic body motif. I'm going to pause here and create a separate video for the border.